For France's oyster farmers, these are worrying times. A mysterious ailment is destroying stocks, killing off 50 to 80 percent of young oysters over the last two years. No one knows exactly what's causing it, a virus, bacteria or even rising sea temperatures. But help is now at hand. A new laboratory set up in western France is trying to genetically identify oysters that are more disease resistant. Using the same species of oyster, we're trying to identify which oysters could be used to breed oyster spats that are more resistant than others. To preserve the species' biodiversity, the laboratory hopes to breed 240 different oyster families of 30 to 40,000 larvae every year. If they reach maturity, the oysters will be transferred to open water farms dotted along France's Atlantic coast where their resistance to disease can be tested. It's always possible that it won't work because we don't know for sure what's killing the oysters. What's triggering the disease could well be in the genetic makeup of the oyster, but that's unlikely. There's a 90% chance this will work. Concrete results aren't expected until 2015. But the project carries the hopes of France's 15 to 20,000 oyster farmers who are facing their worst crisis in 40 years.